Well, day two of muzzleloader. Had more rain. Uh, didn't hunt this morning. I'm hunting. About to go in now for the afternoon. A buddy of mine just snuck up and stalked. Well, I don't know where he's hunting, but a buddy of mine just put a spot and stalk on a doe just a little while ago. So it's one of those days. I'm going to stay on the ground. I'm going to spot and stalk or just set up on a field edge or maybe cross a creek and set up uh, on an oak tree. I don't know. I'm going back to an area that I don't hunt very often, but it's got a lot of deer and it we got a good wind for it today as well. So nobody's parked here. It's kind of a, it's kind of weird. It's been like in the seventies, windy, rainy for opening weekend and the hunting pressure just not here. Like all these spots where I expect to see vehicles parked, like I'm not even really seeing tire tracks. I mean, it's some of the least pressure I've seen for a muzzleloader opener anyways. I'm sure that'll change here in a couple weeks when rifle opens. I barely left the truck and I see a deer in this patch of woods. Oh, they ran. I think it's two fawns. There's often a couple deer in this patch of woods. There's some red oaks and stuff. It was two, I think it was two fawns. I couldn't tell for sure. I think more one might have been a button buck. Field over there. We're probably going to... That was a cow. You're probably going to end up sitting on the edge of that field, but there's a lot of red oaks in here, and deer are definitely still on the acorns. Now, I think something is going to show in that field this evening, but these deer are still favoring acorns. Acorns better than corn most of the time. This ladder stand has been here at least a couple years. But there's a shooting house. The ladder stand's on the property line. There's a shooting house on the neighboring property that was not there last time I was here. It's been a couple years since I've walked these woods. Okay, that was, that was fun. I hate yellow jackets. I wish they didn't exist. That's a buck.
I'm sliding into a spot I've bow hunted a couple times. Haven't shot anything in here, but I've been seeing a lot of deer. Some younger bucks hanging around just about every day, but... Man, there's a boat up in here. I don't know where they're at, though. It's not a big piece of land, so I'm not sure. I'd assume they're in this chunk of woods right here. I have no idea where the person with this boat is, but uh, we're not gonna set up in the woods like I was. I'll assume they're in there. We're just gonna hunt this field edge here, this field corner. I'm not sure where they were set up, but that dude walked right past me. No orange, he's bow hunting, which is fine. You can bow hunt during a muzzleloader, but you gotta wear orange. 743, I guess he had to go to work or something. I'm gonna go uh, climb down, charge my phone a little, uh, get something to eat, and hunt somewhere different this afternoon. It's been dead here. I'm gonna give the spot a rest. Somebody else been hunting it too. I'm gonna give it a rest and go try somewhere else this afternoon. setting up and hunting tonight I'm kind of riding around checking spots just to get some intel maybe I'll be here for like 10 or 15 minutes I'm just gonna sit here like 10 minutes 15 minutes I don't even think I sat 10 minutes. She toast. Let's go get her. That was quick. We'll go get her down by the water. So I can wash everything off. 